so a lot of people still do not know the client that I'm currently using and I'm going to be putting the link in the description if you want to I guess give this client a try it's called conduit and of course it is pretty safe otherwise I wouldn't be using it so if you want to go and check it out it will be in the description well then it's been such a long time since I have gotten a runecrafting level but yes, 78 room crafting, and why am I doing room crafting again? Well, I got more time to do stuff, so I don't mind doing a bit of skilling. And uh, this is beneficial though, because when I need to chill, I can make some blood runes. And it's really nice, since I am going back to doing a lot of burst and slayer, I need those blood runes anyway, so I'll be able to get a lot of blood runes just from chill uh, rune crafting at Zaya, so that's really nice. Yes, 139 dust devils, dude. Really nice bursting task here. Uh, I might start just uh, extending these guys to be honest. Just because uh, I got plenty of time, you know, to actually not AFK nowadays. So, bursting task is definitely one of the best tasks that I could ever do. It just has so much, you know, things going for it, like totems, superiors, and all that. On top of it being really fast to do, no matter like the size. So, definitely gonna go ahead and uh, extend some tasks. So there are a few tasks that I remember uh, extending and bursting a lot at the catacombs for my uh, original Hawk Iron Man. And they are the Anku task. I'm definitely going to be uh, extending this. And also a few other ones here. The Dust Devil task, of course. Really good. And this should be Necrails and the Abyssal Demons. So let's go ahead and extend these. Abyssal Demons are a little tricky though because... Uh, sometimes it may be hard to find a world, but it should be fine. Oh my god. Oh shit. I can't skip this, man. Damn, dude. 192 aviancies. My god. Dude, this guy wants me to go get that health so freaking much. My goodness, guys. My prediction was correct. I would and will hit... 90 hunter before I complete uh, the armadillo set. That's crazy guys That is another level 90 skill Which is honestly very surprising that I would get hunter this high on this account But am I gonna get even more hunter levels though? Or is this gonna be the last task I need to complete the armadillo set? Something really interesting happened yesterday, but I Unfortunately, didn't get to record it, but one of my viewers told me about a uh, Dragon Imp and a Lucky Imp both in the same spot at the Troll Stronghold and I managed to get both and I got myself like 200 Dragon Dart Tips from the Dragon Imp link, which is amazing, you know I'm gonna eventually be able to make that and uh, from the second ever Lucky Imp link, I only got 12 Onyx Bolts Nice, got the third Ecumenical Key so if you guys didn't know, there's actually a 3 minute timer where you can't get another ecumenical key for another 3 minutes unless you hop or log out, so make sure to definitely do that or else you're going to waste a lot of unnecessary time. Ah, god damn it. Oh, come on, there was an ecumenical key right there too. God damn it, man. Freaking ecumenical key. And then some noob was there. Oh well. I'm going to see if I can uh, sneak back and get this ecumenical key from them really fast. We should be good. Snatch. Perfect. Oh, Dark Relic. Okay. Right there, man. More into the farming, you know, goal right here. Yes. Under 200k to 90 farming now. Oh, nice, dude. Got a Godsword Shard. Okay. Not a bad start at all, man. Got to shard and then also I got a hard clue as well, so that's cool. Got this hard clue first trip of the AVNC's task. Room play body T and a Zami page. All right, Zami page four. Oh, yo, is this a unique item? Oh my goodness. Yes. Never mind. I thought I had a set coming up, but yeah, I still need a lot. But cool. And that is. The armadillo task complete. Oh damn, dude! For some silly old coins, 594 KC with no sights of the hilt. Wow, man, almost there to 600 KC. Got two hard clues from that armadillo task. So uh, yeah, let's check it out. Oh, Sarah Dillman page two. 
Oh, whoa. I didn't notice this. As a reward for completing over 300 hard clues. Wait, I didn't complete over. I completed exactly 300. You have now unlocked the Yuri Transforming Mode. Dude, that's PogChamp, bro. Yo, let me check that out. Where is that? Oh, cool, cool. All right, let me zoom in for this. You guys ready? Oh, yeah. I'm a double agent for once. Yo, that's dope. Is that... Wow, that must be like 5 million GP. Yes. Dark Totem Top. Perfect. That is my 4 totem now. Once I hit uh, 10 totems, I'm going to go ahead and try out my luck as Gotizo. Uh, I will be definitely doing every single hard clue because I still need those emote clue items for my masters. And of course, maybe get some uh, cool items that came out recently such as obviously the pet or like that dark claw okay so i finished another dark beast task and dark beast i have killed 816 and let me type this in the bank here we go dark bow ah where's the dark bow well i never got a dark bow from dark beast and I pretty much gotten like everything, you know, from uh, Slayer monsters unique wise. Obviously, I guess excluding uh, pets and whatnot, and like imbue hearts and eternal rings, like the normal unique. That's the only thing I'm missing. I would love to use that uh, at Zora. All right, let's get another task. Oh my God! What the hell is this? How do I keep getting Aviancy's tasks so often? Wow, that's freaking crazy, guys. Jagex is straight up taunting me, dude. Keep giving me these AVNC's tasks and, uh, yeah, not giving me the hilt. But, yo, I gotta take every opportunity I can get. And 200, I think that's maximum right now. Uh, because I didn't extend them. That's crazy, though. 200 AVNC's, so that's exactly 50 Armadale kills that would be uh, added up to the KC once I finish that. I just recently hit 600 KC, just one kill behind, but yeah, just started the new task that I got last night. Um, if I can get some food drops. Oh, nice, I got an elite clue scroll. Oh, hell yeah, man. Not the best trip I've had, but dude, I will take that elite clue scroll though. Oh, what a long bone. Okay, this time... I believe they made a recent update where I will not be able to turn this into uh, Bones to Peaches, so that's good. Alright, not exactly sure what number this is. I am closing in on uh, 30 Master Clue Scrolls, so let's check this out, man. What we get? Okay, last three Master Clue Scrolls has just been, you know, on the mess side, but I'll take the U seeds, man. A lot better than your uh, normal, your usual rewards, I guess, so. Aw, oh, damn, 644kc. Dang, dude, we are we are dry, bone dry for this hilt, dude. It's crazy. It's been a while since I've been on such a, like, a long-term, you know, singular item grind like this. The one time my Slayer Cape perk works is for our AVNC stats. Uh, you know what, man? I'll take it, dude. Give me the freaking goddamn AVNC stats. God damn it. I shall... Go back for Armadale round 2 tomorrow. I mean, round whatever at this point. Okay, this is going to be my last catch. Because I'm going to get a Hunter level. And I have about 90 in the bank. So I have a thousand chins. That's more than enough for this Armadale task. So that is uh, pretty crazy. We are seriously getting some insane Hunter levels. Just from doing Armadale grinding. 613k. 292 halfway point of 99 hunter. Holy shit. That's crazy All right, oh my god Wow That fucking blows That's my third dragon throne X Damn bro Oh Damn that that blows Ugh. Oh well Oh my god, a rune battle axe? Man, dude, I just got two rune battle axe. Wow, dude, that's my second one from uh, Armadillo. Ridiculous, man, ridiculous. Please, please, let me just get this kill, man. Thank you. Alright. Oh, no, this must... Oh, this is gonna be the last kill, then. I'm so tired of Armadillo. I've, I've been doing Armadillo tasks four days in a row. 
straight up and yeah this is basically two kills left of the task so I'm just gonna be leaving right after that but yep there is a uh, still no sign of that hilt which is quite quite sad I'm almost 700 KC now and uh, yeah this this hilt is so goddamn elusive man oh my god why another Armadale test that's five days in a row I just want to do some nice slayer where I can like AFK or like I don't know just burst but you keep giving me this armadillo task and I just can't not get this help yeah anyways I'm gonna be 700 plus KC tomorrow at armadillo so time to do that but I gotta collect chins again so that's that's always fun always fun so on the last episode I told you guys about my new slayer goals which is uh, to eventually hopefully get in view hard and collect totems for some scotizo content and uh, this week I did do a lot of slayers as you can see but it has only been at Armadil because I just keep getting avian seas tasks I've been getting one every single day for the past five days and uh, every single task is basically about five hours because I need to spend two hours catching chins and then about three hours doing the task so yeah every day I spend five hours doing Armadil and yeah that takes a lot of my time unfortunately I really want to do some normal slayer but like I don't know Jagex really wants me to get that Armadale hill and you know I told myself I would never skip an Armadale task so I might as well you know use that opportunity to uh, hopefully get this Armadale hilt I will be wrapping up this uh, Armadale task in the next episode and I really really hope this will be the task that will get me that armadillo hilt and if you didn't already know that is my last god wars item that i need to complete all the god wars armor set and yes the final god wars grind is uh, certainly proving to be challenging i have the three god swords of course and i'm just waiting for the last god sword to be completed and then it's gonna be oh baby you know one of my biggest goals on this account that i've said probably since uh day one of this account hopefully we can close that chapter soon and of course i also got another dragon axe my third one that is quite unfortunate i guess my race luck is really uh, starting to go downhill which i knew was coming you know you can't get lucky at race forever so anyways i'm gonna wrap up today's video here guys thank you guys so much for watching and if you would like to stay up to date with future episodes for this series then feel free to subscribe to the channel and other than that i hope to see you guys soon with another video in a few days take care guys